Hey, hey, how's it going? Um, yeah, welcome in, welcome in. Uh, today we'll be playing The Wolf Among Us, which is not exactly on the screen right now because I'm tabbed out. Um, yeah, um, I'm actually quite nervous playing this game. Um, I don't exactly know why, but if I recall correctly, this game is pretty dark. I have played this game before, a very, very long time ago, but I've not completed it. Um, and back then, the game was pretty laggy for me. So yeah, I'm wondering how my um, I'm wondering how this PC will handle it. Uh. Yeah, uh, what else was I going to say? Uh, game is pretty dark and yep, I've said that. Uh, it's not my first time playing but I didn't finish it. Yep, said that as well. Um, yeah, I think we can just jump in. Okay, let's bring up the game. Hang on. Um, alright. The game should be- yep, okay. You should be hearing the sound as well, I see it sending true. It might be a bit too soft, but I don't know. Uh, let me know if it's- uh, the audio is uh, need balancing. But yeah, um, I guess we just- we just play. Uh, click anywhere to begin. The wolf among us, let's go. What's it connecting to? <laughs> okay. It's loading. Right, okay. Um, let me check my save files. Right, yeah. <laughs> Right, okay. Wow, that is such a long time ago. As you can see, the last time I played was 2015. So, yeah, and it's only episode 3. As far as I'm aware, this game has 5 episodes? Question mark, question mark. Um, yeah, so I. It's safe to say that I forgot pretty much the entire story. I just hope that I don't screw up. Um, yeah, okay. Whew, let's just do it. Uh, no, let's change the save file and let's go with the new one. Yeah, I might just delete the. Mm, no, maybe I'll keep it for legacy. For legacy skate? No, sick, sick. <laughs> wow, okay. I'm. I don't know why I'm so nervous. Um, okay. Let's start. This game series adapts to the choices you make. This story is tailored by how you play. Okay, that much I do remember. So my choices- oh. Once upon a time in New York City, there lived a community of fairy tale characters known as Fable Town. The fables who lived there arrived hundreds of years ago after they were exiled from their homelands. Through the use of a magic spell called Glamour, they have protected their secret community from the mundane world. Sheriff Big B Wolf protects them from each other. Okay. So we're playing as Big B. Rule 5 today again if you missed it. A record for the date. Hottest ever in June. Uh, 103 now. And that humidity looks low. But remember, the hotter the air is, the more moisture it can hold. So 103 with 31% humidity is a lot more humid than, say, 73 with 31% humidity. And it is muggy out there. Ooh.
Yeah, I remember the graphics. It's so cool. The Wolf Among Us. I remember. Yep. I think I have a fondness for such uh, graphics. Like it's very comic book style ish. You know. Oh hey. I'm actually wearing the same outfit as Big B. <laughs> what a coincidence. Tenement building, South Bronx, sometime after midnight. Okay. Oh, it's... Oh. Mr. Toad? Oh, shit. Big B! Listen, mate, I, I know I don't look human. It's a problem, I get it. I just stepped out the apartment for just a second to see what kind of damage this drunk shit is doing. Just cut me a break, yeah? I'll get me glamour first thing in the morning. Cross my arm. Um. No need mm, to kick up a fuss. Sure. Look, no harm done. I'll give you a pass, but listen. If you can't afford to look human, you're going to the farm. It's as simple as that. You can't send me up to live with those animals. You know what I mean. Go see a witch. <laughs> Get a glamour. Big B, they're bleeding me dry, mate. The quality of the spell goes down, but the rates keep climbing up. Do you have any idea how much it costs to have an entire family in glamour? Okay. Hmm, I don't make the rules, though. I don't make the rules. Sorry. I can't give you a free pass on this, Toad. My hands are tied. Right, right. There's too much at stake. Whatever it costs, it's worth it. You don't want me catching you out of glamour again. Oh. Fuck oh, wow. Now. See, this is what I told you about, Sheriff. You're just gonna stand there, do something, Big B, before he completely tears up the place. I should probably go handle this. Yes, please. Thank you. Okay, I don't remember the choices being so... Furry prick job shite. Tell me how to spend my money. <laughs> Dad, Whoops. the lights are shaking again. What did I say? You want a big bad wolf to take you away? No. Then get that fuck back inside. Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah, I was gonna say, I don't remember the... Um, choices being so. Ooh. Okay. Let me pause for a second. Wow. Okay, that's a lot of f words <laughs> at the start of the game. Um, I don't think there's a sensor for that. Ooh. Okay. Um. What was I gonna say? Right, I don't recall the options being so... Uh, this Distorted? No, that's not the word. Uh, so... Like, it's like you don't uh, really see what you're picking, if that makes sense. Like, I didn't expect... I mean, I wanted to let Toad go, but apparently my options made it seem like I'm not letting him go. Uh, okay, so... I don't know. Uh, I guess I should stop relying on my memory. Anyway, for a start, this still is looking pretty nice, I guess. Um, and... I hope my computer can play it. I mean, it looks like it's running smoothly, but I did see like a jittery moment. I'm not sure if it went through. Hopefully it stops, I guess. Anyway, let's go on. Um, oh, matchbook. Okay. Oh. So the face is being teared off, torn off. Things you pick up can be useful later. Okay.
All right. Um, nothing else, I guess. Oh, oh, that's paused as well. Okay, that's good to know. Um, can I see if there's any other options for me? Mm -hmm. I guess not. Okay. Let's be nice. Oh, the door is open. God damn you! Oh. No, whoa, 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 now. whoa, hey, Don't... hey! You've got something on your face. Fuck are you talking about, you stupid <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> okay. I'll fucking kill All right. you. Alright, what's going on here? Ooh. What are you gonna fucking do, huh? Get the fuck out of the well. way before you get the axe again. Woody, this is your last warning. If you keep on like this, I won't have any choice but to put you down. Put me down? You've got a shit fucking memory, Wolf. That's not how it went last time. This isn't last time. Ooh. You gotta calm down. Um, um. Had enough? Nope. Yeah, I had a feeling I chose the wrong spot. Fucking challenge. Okay. Wow. Uh. Uh. All right. Fine. Oh, that was a bad idea. Bad idea. Wow, this quick time actions. What, what, what? Okay, I guess, right, fine. <laughs> oh, his ex. Uh oh. Of all buttons, it's a Q. Oh no, should I? Wow, okay. Didn't expect to nail, nail all of that. You should probably get out of here. Look. I'm not leaving until I get what's mine. You're not getting shit, bitch. I'll fucking put you on the ground. Hey, if you can't be nice, I'm gonna make you wait outside. Oh, fucking shit. You broke my jaw. <laughs> <laughs> and still you talk. Fuck you. Okay. What the hell is going on? What happened? A little misunderstanding that turned into a real shit show. Don't worry, you saw the best bits. There's more where that came from, girly. Knock it off! Um. Look, this is just the start of a shitty night for me. I just need the money he owes me, then I can go. Are you alright? I'm hunky-dory. Thanks for asking. Uh. What's your name? Whatever you'd like it to be, handsome. <laughs> Don't make this more difficult than it has to be. Sorry, Sheriff. Wouldn't want to add any difficulty to your night. Why was he hitting you? He asked me if I recognized him, knew who he was. I said I didn't. He started beating on me. Then you showed up, started beating on him. That about cover it, hon? I'm the woodsman, you whore. I saved Little Red Riding Hood from this monster. I cut this fucker open and filled his belly full of <coughs> stones and threw Ooh, him in the wow. fucking river. That's who the fuck I am, you stupid bitch. Uh, would you excuse me for a moment? By all means. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
That is one start to a game. Did I just not wake up? Okay. Right. It looks like some time has passed. Oh, maybe not. Uh oh. Hey Toad. My car. Oh, yeah. whoops. Give me a second. Oh no, by all means. Take your time. Make yourself comfortable. Uh, sorry about the car. We ended up going out the window. Couldn't be avoided. I can't be mad at you. I called you, and you come to help. I can't be mad. But even when you help, things end up more fucked than they started. <laughs> sorry about that. Well, at least you're not fucking dead. Fingers, wow. <laughs> He's still moving around. Oh, I guess not anymore. Thanks. Don't mention it. I'm just getting what he owes me. Yep, go right for there? it. I mean, your eyes and the teeth. You're not really supposed to do that, are you? Not if I can avoid it. Great. The guy's got an axe in his brain. He's not feeling that. It's more from me. He'll be. I'll kill you, you <laughs> fucking bitch. Let me help you. Oh. He's had enough. He's a fable. Son of a bitch can take plenty. Eh, not sure if I should stop it, but well, I don't know. like in Fable Town or something or like the area where I don't know Just come on. why does it seem okay um here yeah. thanks <laughs> who do you work for really These uh -oh. are sealed. Sorry. Huh. What's going on? Hey, you like my ribbon? Um Beautiful. Uh. Thank you. She remembered it. Uh oh. I'm not sure you if I chose correctly. Before. We probably have. We all sort of knew each other at one point or another. But things change, I guess. I guess. Who is she? I don't remember. Oh, okay. Shit. Stop. We don't have to make any more of a thing out of it than it already is. Are you sure? Uh, he's had enough. For tonight, at least. Wouldn't be surprised if he has an axe to grind, though. <laughs> I like that pun. That wasn't intentional. Sorry. You sure? Hmm. 
He seems worried or something. A hundred. I'm guessing it'd be bad for you to show up empty handed. I'll be fine. Uh. Let's see, I've got uh, it's 20, 40, 7, 8, 58. It's all I got. Uh, it'll help, right? Take it. It's okay. I'll be fine. You've done enough, really. Just take the money, okay? You got me out of a bad situation back there. Thanks. I'm still gonna need a statement. I have to go drop off what I have. Meet me back at my office then. It's a little late for an office visit, Sheriff. I'll swing by your apartment. How do you know where you I You live in the smallest apartment in the woodlands. Everyone knows that. <laughs> okay. Know. You should get cleaned up. You look like shit. Well, thanks and for the compliment. I don't use that term lightly. Some of these look pretty bad. Wow, tell me what you really think. Okay, did I choose wrongly? Hey, I need to tell you something. Yes. You're not as bad as everyone says you are. Oh, thanks. I'll see you around, Wolf. I feel like I've made a ton of bad choices for some reason. I don't know. Also, I really don't like the um, quick time events. Especially the mashing of the Q button. Oh my goodness. That was... Hmm, not ideal at all. Right. This scene is so cool. I mean, this transition. And there we go. The title. Again! Am I heading back to my office or my apartment? Hmm, I wonder. Episode 1, yeah, Faith. Oh, is that woman Faith then? Who is Faith? Hmm, the Woodland Luxury Apartments. Late. Okay. Let's go. Uh, I wonder if there's anything else I can do around here besides going straight in. Luxury apartments. Wish they wouldn't advertise that. <laughs> I have a feeling it's not very luxurious. Oh, I can't. I can't. Okay. All right. Fine. Guess I can't uh, explore. Bill Willingham. Fables is a comic, right? Hmm, I should actually check that out. Oh, there's nothing on... I guess I can't... Alright, that's fine. How about this way then? Ooh. Oh. What was that? Come on out. Alright, alright. Beauty. Hello, Big B. Beauty. I wasn't expecting anyone. I know this looks a little odd. So, where are you off to? Well, I went for a walk. I don't see what's wrong with that. Didn't say there was. It's not a big deal. Just okay. you know, out. For a walk. That's all. Damn, Why do I'm you? Late. 
Why does she look so suspicious in a way? Please, Bigby. Promise me you won't tell Beast you saw me. Oh. He worries too much as it is, and. Look, whatever it is, it's between you and Beast. I'm staying out of it. I don't have time to go into it right now. I'll explain it all to you later. I will, but I have to go. Hmm, that is suspicious. She's going out so late and meeting someone, it's I presume. Might be thinking. Um, affair? Is it? Hmm. Also, the timing that they give you to choose, it's not very long at all. I wonder if I can pause while... And maybe I should try that the next time. <laughs> okay. Flycatcher needs to dust this guy. Flycatcher? Oh, can I take? <laughs> Nothing's gonna wake up that guy, huh? Well, I guess I should just let him sleep. Let's check out the directory. Ooh. Um, that was too fast, I can't see. Fly catcher. Oh, oh, wow, okay. There's a lot of privates in S White. Storage, I think? K Cole. Who's K Cole? Uh, I apologize. I'm not that familiar with, um, I guess. Uh, these characters. So, I might not understand the reference to who these people are, like B Beard or J Homer. I, I'm fairly sure S White would be Snow White. Then again, I'm not 100% sure. Um, and that's like Mr. and Mrs. Beast. And I don't know who the flycatcher is. Anyway. Mailbox, okay. I got any mail. Let's check if I do. Seventh day in a row. <laughs> well, we gotta check anyway. Who knows, right? Should I disturb him? I I'm kinda curious to see what's what would happen. Hey, you wink? Nope. Grimbo. Mm -hmm. Probably for the best. Oh, alright. I guess I can't do anything. Um, what's on this side? Oh, I guess, yeah, that's pretty much it. Huh. Yeah, I, I got to remember, this is a pretty old game. So I guess there's quite a lot of, uh, at least as in like it's an old mechanic, maybe? Or rather, mm, no. It's not old. How should I say this? Um, like... Uh, okay, never mind. I would not... I, I can't... I can't... Uh, formulate my thought process. Thought process? My thought properly. Oh wait, let me check. Whoops, yep. Controls select oh it's T uh, it doesn't allow me to change oh I guess yeah because it's an old game I don't think games during those times uh, give you the option to hold uh, hold the button instead of uh, pressing it uh, continuously this is one of the things that I was gonna say about it being uh, an old game, an old mechanic. 
Like, I think games these days give you an option to change it to a toggle or a hold down or something instead of like... Oh! I did wonder... <laughs> I didn't see... Oh wait, am I not gonna fix it? Oh, okay. Here. How much longer is this gonna go on? That looks so out of place. Like it's a different color and everything as well. Anyway, so I'm in 204, right? I guess let's head hit home. Hit home, yep. Ding. Bigby, hey, wait up. Oh, have you seen what's my this? Wife? Have you seen Beauty? Oh, Beauty. Um. Nope, haven't seen her. Oh, okay. Sorry to bother you. Damn it. Something's going on. Yep, yeah, it is, but well. I mean, I gave my word, so yeah, I don't want to break it. I think. I don't know, my graphic card maybe Oh, I alright. Should have cracked a window. I'm not sure if you can see the like gums. Well at least it's running more smoothly. Compared to when I played it last time. Uh, what a night. So I don't know. It and it's it's definitely not the game. It's uh my computer. I've been having like graphical glitches. I wouldn't say glitches, but it's like mm, never mind. It's yeah. I shouldn't bore you with my computer stuff. Uh freezer, let's see what's in there. Hello? Didn't you just fill it up again? So that you actually do have ice the next time instead of just leaving it there? Why do I even own this? Should've got <laughs> Eh, I guess. But this place does look like I just uh, use it for sleeping and not like living, you know? I don't know if that makes sense, but- Oh! What the? Who is this? That's the wolf? Hmm, I have no idea who that is, which character that is. Oh, can I? Should help, I guess. Oh, Chinese food. I should probably clean up. Probably a bad sign. <laughs> probably. Can I clean it up? No, I guess not. Tea. Tea doesn't. Um, Bluebeard. Bluebeard's file. Who is Bluebeard? Okay. Mm. Don't think I can do anything else around. I don't see a yep. What's here then? Oh, okay. <sighs> oh, not again. 
Colin. Who's Colin? Uh, oh, hey, Big B. I'm in your chair, huh? <laughs> I've only got the one. So, yeah. Got a smoke? Sure, why not? Thanks. A couple thousand more of these will be even on that house you owe me. This has got to stop. You can't keep sneaking off the farm like this. The fresh air and sunshine pitch they sell you on is bullshit. I didn't escape out of the homelands to end up in some prison, okay? Don't send me back there, Bigby. You don't know what it's like, okay? You haven't been there. Come on. That's a little dramatic. Uh-oh. I feel like I chose the wrong for me. option again. Nope. The house didn't blow itself down, Bigby. That's all I'm saying. Do with that what you will. Now, I'm not saying it's reason enough for me to have definitely been offered a drink, but, uh... It would have helped ease some of the pain oh. you once caused me, yes. It also I would have see. shown everyone how different you are now. If that was all you were saying, I'd be able to get some rest. I take it all back. This is why everyone hates you. It wasn't murder. I was hungry. Yeah, well, I'm hungry now. You don't see me tearing the flesh off of your bones. But you would if you could. Yep. Probably. But, uh, no. Um, hate's the wrong word. They fear you more than anything. You ate a lot of people back in your day. I didn't choose that, I though. we were all supposed to have a fresh start here. I can't change the past. Well, you can't change people's memories, either. Ah, uh, true that. Look, I'm not saying it's fair. But it's real. People are scared of you. I mean... Look at your hands. Who'd you get in a fight with? A fable, right? I'm sure you're not going around punching Mondays. I was doing my job, believe it or not. Your job is to beat the shit out of fables? <laughs> Sometimes I take them to the farm. Fuck you. Wait, what? You think my job is easy? You try keeping a bunch of fables from killing each other. How do you think this all works? I don't know. How? By being big and being bad. By being big and being bad. Don't say that shit in front <laughs> yeah, of I'm not sure I'm it's embarrassing. being bad at all. That's the attitude that gets you in trouble. I'm sure you were shitty to everyone maybe. you came across tonight. No. Nah. Yeah, Name not everyone. Me. Well, there was a girl. I don't actually know her name. Awesome. Great example. I'm not gonna rat out beauty like Life that. It's easier with friends, Big B. And we live a long fucking time. That is true. I know you Although... like this whole lone wolf thing you got going for yourself. But I've seen the way you look at snow, okay? Oh. You're not fooling me. Will you shut up? Well, maybe if my throat wasn't so parched, I wouldn't have to keep talking. <laughs> Wait, that doesn't make Just sense. Just give me a drink, please. Colin, enough already. I haven't slept in two days. I went out a second story window, and I want to get in two seconds of shut eye before I... Look, if I give you this, will you let me sleep? Yeah, yeah, all right. Probably. Thanks, Big B. Taking a sip in front of him would be so evil, but then again, I guess that's... I don't know. Maybe I'm just too nice or something. That is a very 
awkward way to sleep. I'm pretty sure I'll get a I'll get a neck cramp after that. How long did I sleep though? Colin seems to have left. Wow, this sounds urgent. Big B. Snow. What's up? Come with me. Snow. Snow. What? Sorry, I'm. What is it? What happened? I just can't get into it this second. We need to hurry to. Hi. Hello. Good morning. Or evening. <laughs> yeah. Who is that? These walls are paper thin. We need to be careful. We'll talk outside. <laughs> okay. A lot of suspicious stuff happening, I guess. What is that? I'm scared. Doesn't look like a... Oh! Right. Okay. I'm... I think I remember what's under here, but I don't know who. Do it, baby. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, crap. You knew this girl? Is... She's not a Mundy, right? Who was she? I thought I knew everyone in Fable Town. She looks familiar. A working girl? A working girl? I don't... I mean, I'm a working... Oh. The woodsman. He attacked her and I stepped in. And he threatened to kill us both. No. You don't think he... I don't think anything yet. Just give me a second. It's just... terrible. So, who found her? I did. She was just like this. I didn't touch her. I grabbed Grimble's jacket to cover her with. Then, I came to get you right away. I see. No okay. Else was with you? No. Big P, did one of us do this? There hasn't been a murder in Fable Town in a long time. Okay. All the more reason we shouldn't start a panic before we know what's going on. Yep. I'll have a look around. We don't have much time before people will be coming through here. That is true. Looks like I got a case to solve. Hmm, and she was coming to meet me too. I don't know. Strange cut. What did this to her? What could do something like that? Either something very sharp or something with magic attached to it. She was placed here with some care. What do you mean? You can see that someone didn't just toss her here. She was deliberately placed for us to find. All right. What kind of monster would do this? No idea. Wait, the what? ribbon. It's a ribbon. There's with a ring a kind of symbol here. Huh. I I don't recognize it. Neither do I. Ugh, I'm, 
I'm sorry. This is just so surreal. I guess. Um, what? What do you want to do next? We still have some time. I should keep investigating the area. Okay. Good idea. Should I? I want to cover her. I want to cover her though. Hmm. But anyway, we since we saw this, so I guess we should start with this first. And she was supposed to meet me, right? So whoever did this to her knew about it, I suppose. Blood. Drops of blood. I'd say it's been here an hour, maybe. An hour, so maybe I've slept an hour or so. Grab my fabric, okay. No signs that it's been here long. Fabric. Looks like jeans. Doesn't tell me much. And that's a pretty 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 big piece of fabric. Oh, there's blood there. Let's see the trash can though. Just some loose trash. Okay. Wait. Okay. Um. Yep. More blood. Someone might have hopped the fence, got caught, and left the trail I found earlier. Blood. Still wet. Sharp enough. Okay, so someone... I had assumed that the blood on the pavement was from the head. Hmm... So what it's suggesting to me is that it's the perpetrator. What is that though? Isn't that like... Oh, I guess it's the red flowers. Okay. Uh, I wonder if there's anything on the other side. Can I even go there? Let's try. Oh. Oh, I guess. Okay. Yep. It stops me here. Okay. What about the front then? I'll talk to you later. Oh. Later. As in after i explore this area oh hmm i guess there's nothing else for me to check out around here that is fine i suppose all right let's talk to you oh what are you doing <laughs> better to be thorough sure just Hurry up. We don't have much time. We should move her before anyone shows up. We'll find out more at the business office. She'll be in the books. I'm sure of it. Big P, do you have any idea what's going on? How did this happen? Why her? This is a message. A message? I don't know, Bigby. I get complaints at the office all the time, but... Just what about this makes you think that? Whoever did this isn't exactly hiding it. The placement of the head, it's exact. Purposeful. She was placed here precisely for us to find. All of us. Well... Yes. I guess you're right. The killer wanted us to know what they had done. Oh, did I choose the right one? <laughs> I'm, I'm not sure. Have to talk Crane about this. Who as is Crane? As long as Cole is gone, he's acting mayor. He needs to know, and he's going to find out anyway. So we right. may as well get out in front of it. It'll just be worse if he finds out we held it from him. Okay. I guess it's useless to drag it out. That's how I feel too. I'm sure he won't be happy, but it's just part of the process. Hopefully he can be rational about it. I wouldn't hold my breath. <sighs> I'm not. I just don't want him interfering. 
Interfering. Hmm. Crane's not what's important right now. We need to figure out who this girl was so we can find whoever did this. Take this back to Dr. Swinehart. He can take a look at it. I'll meet you at the business office. Oof. This is... Hmm... What, are you blind? What, you don't see there's a line? I've been standing here a half hour already. You get to just walk in? Must be nice being the sheriff. Do whatever the fuck you like. I work here. And what great work you do, sheriff. Hmm, that didn't feel very genuine. <laughs> Fucker. Okay. Wow. This. Wow. Yes, I see. I, I... Because you are the one bringing this to me, Miss Snow. The one who so simply stumbled upon this catastrophe on our very doorstep. The last thing I need with Mayor Cole away is a hysteria. Do you understand me? Yes, of course I Don't do. Don't interrupt me, Miss Snow. You asked me a question. Don't change the subject. You are to blame for this unpleasantness, Miss Snow. I brought you this news as soon as I could. You are trusted to keep things running smoothly around here. This is a okay. disaster. Who else is to blame if not you? It isn't anyone's fault. Instead of trying to assign blame, maybe we should figure out how to catch the fucker who did this. Oh, is that how you see things? Sheriff, you are the one charged with protecting the citizens of Fable Town. Your failure to do so cost someone their life and the safety of the entire community. Tell me you've been doing something. Are there any leads? Suspects? Anything. Anything at all. Any shred wow. of evidence you two know what the hell you're doing. Because right now, I have half a mind to fire the both of you. Bluebeard came to mind. It's his M.O. It's shaky, but... Don't be absurd. Bluebeard is out of the country as we speak. So don't even think about accusing him of such a treacherous affair. If all you're operating off of is ancient history, we're all in much more trouble than I imagined. You two need to get a handle on this situation quickly and quietly. The last thing we need is all of Fable Town knowing there's a killer amongst us. You're certainly no. not helping. Yes, sir. Call Vivian right this minute and let her know I'm coming in early for my massage. I will. Where is the bottle of wine you were to purchase? Don't oh, bother. Forget it. Can't do anything right. Do your job, Sheriff. Or we'll find someone who can. Yeah, I'm not gonna say he anything. would've just pissed him off more. All right. Well, that could've gone better. Well, maybe we should've dragged it out. For what it's worth, I still think it was better to tell him. Yeah, maybe. This office oh, is pretty Crane fancy, like though. Smoking and... Never mind. Smoke away. What's the wine about? Into a massage? Probably a gift. The weird part of that is that he's actually being nice to someone. I know I bought that damn bottle. Oh. Is, is he gone? Yes, thankfully. Did you steal the wine? Yeah, okay. Buffkin! Hello, Miss Snow. Drinking? This early? Where did you get that? It was by Mr. Rickabod's desk. <laughs> and don't you think it probably belongs to him? Maybe. Wow, so many problems. How are you today, Mr. Bigby? You're cheery. Uh, fine. fine. Thanks for asking. Buffkin, get the books. Which books? The ones with all the fables in it. I'm not sure that was any more specific. Bring the first <laughs> three. Be back in a few minutes. Wow. He knows the ones I'm talking about. There's bound to be information on her here. Somewhere. We'll at least be able to get her real name from the books whenever Buffkin finds them. In the meantime, poke around. Maybe the mirror can help. The mirror? I really have to get this 
appointment squared away, but let me know if you need anything. All right. Hello. Okay. Ooh, let me pause. Wow, that's a lot to take in. Um, that Ichabod crane is such an... I don't know, maybe he's like a stereotype of all politicians or something? Or I... is gaslighting and, and speaking over someone else and just... Wow, that, that character is something. Uh, I'm trying to recall who Ichabod Crane is. The name is somewhat familiar, but I can't seem to remember it. Um, and Buffkin is kind of, <laughs> kind of innocent looking, even though he's drinking. Um, okay. Anyway, that's all I remember Hi. that I want to so say. Well. But yep. Hi. Yeah. Lamp. Sure. Okay. Oh. Okay, I guess this is Aladdin's lamp. Worth a try. <laughs> okay. I question if only drinking amounts to something a bit excessive. What else can I see here? Snow White. Uh. That's not- oh, wow. This game- oh, okay. There's an invisible wall here, right? That's fine. I'll be sure to let him know. Oh, right. I wanted to say that- uh, oh. That's not a wow. I did not notice that, but- Okay. Thanks. There is a- Yep. I don't- oh my god, did it turn? Yes, it's turning. Wow, that's creepy. That is so creepy. Okay. Yikes. I, yeah, I wanted to say that this office is very magical. I mean, the space in here it's definitely doesn't look like it fits the building, you know? So I'm pretty sure they have some sort of magic. Uh, that actually uh, enlarges the space. Yeah, but this is so creepy. Tarot deck. Ooh. Let's take a look at it. Tarot cards. Jack brought them back from Appalachia. Who knows where they were before then? Who is Jack? What he did to get them. Can I play with it? Play? I mean, use it. Strength. It comes in all forms. Oh. Can I pick it again? Oh, I can. Hmm. Just what the fuck is this supposed to mean? What indeed? That seems like the future or something. The first two already sort of passed, came to pass. Like the first card is probably Big B and someone. Um, and the second card is the lady in front of the tower. Okay, let's try the mirror. Magic mirror. This has got to be... Uh, is it Snow White? Yeah, I think it's Snow White. A stepmother, right? Mirror, mirror on the wall. Hey, Magic Mirror, I got a question. You know the rule. I don't have time for this shit. Your impatience is callow. You're needlessly cruel, but have some respect for our history and rules. <sighs> Mirror, mirror, uh, if you're able, tell me all about this fable. See, was that so hard? Yeah, I I'm guess I have two to rhyme. Away from kicking a hole in you. There's no need for that. 
Fine. Of which fable do you wish to know? Um... I don't know her name. I don't know her name. Not yet, anyway. Well, until you do, I can't help you. I see. Okay, woodsman. Show me the woodsman. Where is he? What you see is complete. The woodsman stumbles down a street. All right. Oh, shit. Which street? I'm sorry, Bigby. I can only show you what can be seen. Okay. Can I... Will he show me the same thing, though? Show me the woodsman. Oh, it's a different thing. Show me. What about now? Oh, okay. I guess it's repeated now. Buffkin. Show me Buffkin. Hey, put down the bottle and get to work. <laughs> Still looking. <laughs> Show me Buffkin. Let's see. Hey. Put down the bottle and get to work. <laughs> Still looking. Okay. How about snow? Show me snow white. Not that is a little class. trippy. She's in this very room. What Show about me snow white? Okay. It's the same. Not I was just curious. Request. She's in this very room. Indeed, indeed. I guess that's Nobody it. Right. Very well. Please return should you wish to ask about someone else. Or someone new. Alright. <sighs> well, I'm sure we'll get it all cleared up. Okay. Thank you. How does Buffkin function though with that much alcohol? Alright, let's go take a look. Do -do 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 -do. Oh. Book of symbols. Oh right, to find a ring. Find a ring? We'll start with these. Any information the symbol on, on the ring. In community will be somewhere in these books. All right. Um. Okay. Colin and his brothers. Ah, uh, right. That was the other thing that I was gonna say as well. Colin is the three little pigs, right? Three little pigs, the one that built the. Is it three little pigs? Wow, I'm so rusty on these childhood stories. Beast. Beauty and the Beast. Hmm. I think her name was Red. She didn't make it out. Oh. She didn't make it out. What does that mean? Red Riding Hood's knight in shabby armor. <laughs> yep, and his axe. That's me. And there's me. Not a good day. This is. I'm pretty sure that's supposed to be me. I see. Yeah, dwarves. Less said about that, the better. Right in front of Snow White, though. I'm pretty sure they were kind to Snow White. Oh, who's this? Oh. Huh. Seen this before. Oh, that's the symbol. This symbol on the man's clothes. It's the same as the rings. Could be her father or husband. This has most of the emblems of the old days and usually what family they come from. If it's in here, we'll have her name. Oh, I guess I found a clue, but I want to see the rest of the stuff. Oh, who are these? I haven't seen Badger around for a while. He likes Badger. His I wish Toad would like his a bit more. <laughs> nice. That's dad. Toad. 
Oh. Ichabod Crane. Scared shitless. What's that? Your boss. His finest moment. Hard to understand how he ended up running this place. Well, maybe it's time that changed. Yeah, maybe. Right, Ichabod Crane. It's the um. What's that? What's that story called? With the headless hunter. Hunter? Headless huntsman? Oh wow, I'm blanking out on the story. But yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I remember who this character is. Alright. I guess let's move on. Check the symbol. <laughs> My arms are still arms. My hand knuckles. Knuckles are still red. Red and bloody, I suppose. This is definitely not the symbol. What? I can't read any of this shit. I can help. <laughs> oh, thank you. Yeah, thanks. We look out for each other. Don't overdo it. Buff can <laughs> translate. Hmm. An exquisite design from the good China of Toad Hall. Mr. Toad? He probably wrote this in himself. Toad Hall, I see. Okay. Um, that's the Huntsman. Uh, yep, definitely not that one. Okay. Wait, wasn't? What's? Oh, Elvish text. Oh. What's it say about that? It says Brickle Bit in an older Elvish hand. What's Brickle Bit? A magic word. What's it do? It makes animals shit gold. <laughs> okay. Right. I have no idea what this is a reference to. I kind of want to check out all of the stuff now. What's that? It Just reads, to see what they say. Mark of the house of the Frog Prince. Not quite who I'm looking for. Okay. Wow. This is really interesting looking. Um, right. Oh, is this one, isn't it? This is the one. Where is this symbol from? Which family or story? That's an odd one. Family name? Alelairo? I'll go look it up. Alelairo. That means every kind of fur in German. Donkey skin. Yes. What does it say? Donkey skin girl, also known as donkey skin, also known as <laughs> ass skin, <laughs> prefers to go by the name Faith. Poetic? Buffkin, we don't need the commentary. The story of donkey skin. There was once a great king with a beautiful queen. The queen grew ill and had her husband promise to only marry the most beautiful girl in the kingdom. After a long search, it became clear that the only woman in the land that could match her beauty was... His daughter, Faith. Oh. She had a magic cloak made from the skin of her father's prized donkey that would hide her beauty so she could escape his kingdom. Eventually, she married a prince who could see past the magic cloak and knew her true beauty. And they lived happily ever after. Should I mark it, Miss Snow? Yes. Please. Oof. And what's her husband's name? Lawrence. Prince Lawrence. We got what we well. came for. Well, yeah. Her name's Faith. She was married to Prince Lawrence. I mean, that's more than her we... name was Faith. Yeah. We should talk to the husband. Yeah. We need to. You think he did it? I don't think so. But, um... No, I don't. But we need to let him know about his wife. Oh, man. Yep. Yeah. 
I guess. I don't I don't remember a story about donkey skin though. I guess maybe it's not a common one. Either that or it's an original story just for this game. But the backstory is tragic though. The only woman that is beautiful enough to match the ex ex-wife. I mean the 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 queen is the daughter man that is yeah okay oh hey you didn't see no, this option right. tarot is a backwards art i wouldn't put too much stock in its wisdom bigby not when you've been so helpful <laughs> revisions muddy i'm as clear as a window Okay, I guess you've got a point if you can actually see it instead of um, relying on like uh, cards. I don't know what I'm. Yeah, uh, never mind. Mirror, mirror, blah, blah, able, blah, blah, blah about this fable. Of which fable do you wish to know? Um, Faith's father. Show me Faith's father, the old king. Oh, wow. Died in battle, I guess. Suspect list. I wonder. <laughs> Would it be too cruel to show this? Show me. Show me Faith. Through powerful magic, her whereabouts concealed. Unfortunately for you, these lips are sealed. Huh. These lips are sealed. It's not my choice of phrasing, Bigby. It's simply the way this has to be. That's not the first time that phrase is said. He's a prince, I think. Show me Prince Lawrence. Wait, what? What's he been doing? Where is this? Where's what? Do you know where Prince Lawrence lives? If he's a prince, probably relocated in the South Bronx. Yellow building, red window shutters. Red frames. Yep, that's the one. I can take us there. Okay, I guess we need to go look at it. It doesn't look like he's alright. I mean, that's quite a lot of blood. Nobody right now. Anything Unless that's wine. Yeah, that'll have to do for now. Come on, we're going over there. Yep, yeah, let's do it. Thank you, Mira. Oh. Sorry, I have to get that. You go do that. Hello, Woodland's business office. Yes, I... He is. Hold on. Bigby, it's for you. For me? That is weird. Bigby, it's me, Toad. Oh. You there? What do you want? Bigby, shit. Listen, right? There's a bloke upstairs going through all the woodsman's things. Get over here, Big B, before he. Oh, wait, hang on. Boy, shit. Hey! Oh, man, what's, what's happening? happening? Hard to say. Something going on over at Toad's place. What about Faith's I got to. I don't know. I couldn't really tell. But he could be in trouble. And we should go there anyway to search her apartment. Toad might have to wait. Hmm. Whenever you're ready. Am I supposed to make this decision then? To either go to Toad, help Toad first, or... Hmm. I don't know, both seems urgent, right? Toad might be in trouble because it does sound like somebody is rummaging through a lot of things there. But the husband is... I don't know. Husband... Prince Lawrence seems like he's done something pretty bad. I don't know if we'll be in time to save him, honestly. But I don't want to... Man, this is a tough decision. Oh, but Bigby said that um, 
we should go to the Prince Lawrence first, right? So maybe I don't have to. There? Oh. Was it the woodsman? I don't know. It's possible. Whoever it was, it didn't seem like Toad was happy to see him. Well, maybe Prince Lawrence can wait. Yeah, he didn't see him. He could use some help too. Well, where to first? I do have to choose. Oh, Baby. wow. Listen, right? There's a bloke upstairs going through all the woodsman's things. You think he did it? What's her husband's name? Lawrence. Prince Lawrence. Oh, man. Oh, man. Is there a timer? I hope not. This is a tough decision. Um. I don't know. I really don't know. Uh, uh, the thing is, I feel like, I feel like Lawrence has already gone past the, uh, time frame for help, but Toad might still, will Toad, uh, I don't know, does he need, like, actual help help? I'm I'm fairly sure that he might, you know, just stay behind and protect himself, right? Hmm, this is tough. Very tough. I And I'm notorious for not being able to choose quickly. Uh... <laughs> um... I don't know. What should I do? Man. I'm really... Okay, usually... <laughs> Alright, a little bit of back... Mm, backstage stuff. Behind the scenes stuff, I suppose. Whenever I record, like, games or stuff, and um, I'm faced with a decision, I usually spend a lot of time thinking, and it's usually cut out in the final game a uh, final game final video uh right now you're literally seeing how long i actually do take when i make decisions sometimes uh, <laughs> and yeah i am i don't know i'm so conflicted it's such a simple choice too well i guess it's simple for some people it's really difficult for me. Uh, and it's one of those things like do you actually save someone or go like if you are 80% sure that person is already already gone do you actually go there to make sure or do you take that risk and go to someone else that you might actually save in time and you know they are you know in need of help at this moment then again there is a possibility that we might uh, 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 oh my god, I, oh, okay, I'm just going to go to Toad. Toad sounds like he needs help right now. We can check in on Prince Lawrence after. Okay, I'm not looking forward to breaking the news to him anyway. I don't know. I feel like I've made the wrong decision, but I'm pretty sure if I picked uh, Lawrence, I would feel like I made the wrong decision as well. And we ended up going out the window, and I landed on Toad's car. You guys made a real mess. Yeah. Looks worse than a day. Wow, it does. Is somebody up there? It kind of looks like it. Hey! Wait here. I definitely shouldn't make a sound. Shh. 
shit. I should have kept quiet. Ah. Uh... I'm sorry. That's enough, all right? Just shut it. What? I don't even remember half of this shit. Wait, what? I guess I check check out what's happening outside. Hmm, what is going on? Oh, should I explode? Mm, never mind. Is I'm already down son? here. Toads, I think. Be nice in there, okay? I'll try. I'll try. Hey, Toad, you in there? Oh. <laughs> Big B. And Miss White. Surely you didn't come all this way just for my bother. Mm. Sorry, Big V. It's embarrassing to have to admit, but uh, I thought there was someone else in Woody's place. There wasn't, though. Uh, not when I checked. <laughs> Nothing but a leaky drain pipe. Imagination was right. the best of me. So, you know, false alarm. Sorry for dragging Miss White into this. What's going on? What do you mean? Nothing's going on, Big B. I don't know what you mean. Truly. False alarm is all. Sorry. Hmm. Are you alright? He's fine, Miss White. Just stung his little toe. Better swimmer than Walker, just like his dad. Wanna... So, I guess you'll be taking off now. No need to hang around here anymore. I mean, I'm sorry you came all the way here for nothing. Someone was here, and something's going on. Just so this trip wasn't a complete waste of time, I'm gonna look around a bit before we leave, okay? The longer that you seems... talk, the longer this takes, so just stand over there and shut up. All right, all right. I just don't want to waste your time, is all. That was so uh, have rude. A seat. Have a cup of tea, whatever you like. <laughs> wow. Grown ups, am I right? Uh. Hey, you know what? Flycatcher said you had a pretty awesome insect collection. I'd really love to see it. Is it in your room? It has a weevil. Cool. Just mind the upholstery while you're looking for nothing. Yeah, sure thing. Hmm. How'd this happen? Fucking hell. Damn thing must have fell off the table. Uh-huh. Unlikely. Fell off the table. Or the boy was faffing about, playing sods and swordfish. Who knows with the lad? Yeah, it's definitely not from this table because both sockets are unused. So it seems to have been thrown here, I guess. Let's see, oh, what is that? He's bleeding. Why is that it's blood? Still fresh. Oh, well, I cut me end. <laughs> Ran around like a tit trying to pick out a wrap. Must have got some on the furnishments. Lamp in pieces, blood on the wall. It's awful, I know. Sounds painful. Oi, don't you go mothering now. The wound didn't sit very long, you know. Perks of being a fable, I suppose. <laughs> and a frog. He's covering up for the person 
Ah, oh, the lamp was here. I presume. And then it got thrown there. That more blood? No. Just a clean space in the dust. Did you move something? Ah, oh, maybe one of Junior's toys or something. I mean, who knows? Definitely the lamp. If you're gonna say something, out with it. That broken lamp used to be here, right? Just tell me what happened. Nothing happened, mate. Nothing! And why did the lamp have to be there? Of all the blooming pointless inquiries. It's my own place. Don't you think I'll know what happens in it? Because the lamp was always over here, Toad. It was over here, and now it's there. The space in the dust is from where you oh, moved I it. I did some refiguring. Who fucking cares? Bloody hell, mate. Come on, get off with this. Hmm, okay. Oh, no, 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 no. Go down, go down, go down, go down. There was the poker, fire poker, right? Yep. It's covered in blood too. Could so there was a dusting. fight. Oh no. So what happened? What happened? There's fresh blood on the tip. I could smell it from the door. Oh, I was I was poking the coals and it slipped a bit. Sliced up in my foot like a seashell. Looked like a shit ugly thing. Okay, Sheriff. Now what? Uh. Wait, you dropped it on your foot? You told me before that you cut your hand. Yeah, no, I, I did cut my hand. I cut my hand first, and that made me drop the damn thing on my foot. <laughs> uh, ruinous flip of events, really. Hmm, mm, indeed. Oh my god, will you not make a big faff out of this? There's nothing to solve here, Sheriff. I'm telling you everything that happened. Why don't you believe me? Because all the facts are pointing to something I mean, else. Things happen, you know. This apartment's a goddamn mess, Toad. Looks like after a struggle or a fight. And I don't know why you cover for it. But I know you're lying about something. But I'm not. And you're just going to make it worse for yourself the longer you keep up the act. I'm not bullshitting you. Honest. We'll see. Hmm. What else is there that I can see? Oh. It's closed. Oh. Hang on. There's three. Yeah. Someone came in through the window. Or someone escaped through the window. What is it now? If it's blood, you know what happened, I- No, there's marks here on the window, so. And what's that about? No real reason. Just last night, when I'd come out, I was in a, a downright dizzy, mate, as you would be. <laughs> and I plum forgot the keys to this place. And I had to climb in through the bloody window. Really? Scared Junior off to death. Hmm. It doesn't look like it's a coming in mark though. Although I can't be really sure. Um, what else is there that I can see or do? I feel like I've exhausted all of it here. Maybe it's uh, to talk to Snow now. Busted latch, oh. Your lock's busted. Eh? The lock. It looks like somebody kicked in the door. Oh, for Christ's sake, the fucking lock's been busted for weeks, mate. Right, it's just like Hang everything on. else in this bloody building. Hmm. You said, that, yeah. Why'd you climb in through the window then? Huh? Why'd you climb in through the window? You said it yourself. The lock's been rotten for weeks. 
You wouldn't have needed a key to get in. Fucking hell. Just what are you on about, mate? After the state I was in, I didn't have me head. That's all it was. I forgot a fucking handle was fucking busted. And I'll tell you what else. It's embarrassing. You're bringing all this shit up, all right? So quit it with a third degree and all that. Bigby, come on. I'm begging for mercy over here, old boy. I was looking forward to a nice afternoon. Just me and me son, and you've taken up enough of a day with all this... They're sniffing around at me private belongings. I'm sorry I called. Really, I am. But will you please, please just bugger off? Not yet. No one fought anyone, Bigby. There wasn't any scrap. So when? When are you going to leave? I mean, I feel like I'm on trial here. In my own bloody home. It's not seemly. When? When you start telling me the truth, Toad. Well, I've told you the truth, mate. Jesus Christ, what more do you want? Toad, these stories have made no sense. You didn't cut yourself on the poker. You didn't forget your keys. You didn't bump the lamp off the table. You want to tell me what's going on? She doesn't think much of me, I don't think. Oh, I wouldn't necessarily say that. Progress? Not really. Oh, Toad's Mr. injured. Toad, you're bleeding. Take off the hat. <sighs> it was that butcher, a, a Tweedle, Thumb or D. You gotta strip them down to their Johnnies before you can tell which is which. He come bulging in, screaming about something the woodsman had. Or thought he had, I don't know. He tore up the place, beat me up when I said I didn't have it. I tried to go out the window, but he pulled me back in. <sighs> it's been a hard morning, I could tell you that. You know where the Tweedle went? He mentioned something about Prince Lawrence's. I don't know if he'd already been there, or was going there, but... He said something about it. I would have told you. I wanted to, really, I did. But he said if word of this ever got back to him, if he ever thought you knew, or Miss White, he'd come back and kill my boy. Okay, I can understand why you lie, though. The bastard a coat. You wouldn't take it. Whose coat? The girl. Dad borrows things from people who live here. <laughs> uh, sometimes. Borrows. I don't steal nothing. Turn around here would astonish you, mate. We're merely repossessed what's been left behind. Well, we'll be taking the coat now. If she has next of kin, family, anyone. All right. Fetch him the fur. Fine bit of dress it is. Did they hide it under the fireplace? Oh. No, I wouldn't wear it outside. Right, it's the Wait. bonky skin thing. It's an envelope. Fucking hell, of course there is. If my luck, it's a map to some bloody doubloons. It's addressed to Prince Lawrence. Do you want to try and give it to him, or...? Hmm... Doesn't seem right opening another man's mail. Let's try and give it to him. Okay. Well, it's been quite a surprising day for all of us, hasn't it? I'd see you out, but I'm afraid of dripping any more blood in the place. It was very nice talking to you, TJ. Thanks. Uh, see ya. Oh, we didn't- okay, I guess I missed the chance to explore the apartment a bit more. Oh well. Does it wells. always go that smoothly? Nope. Not often. So, the prince's now? Lawrence's, yeah. It's our best lead. Our only lead, really. When you put it that way. Hmm. Okay, I feel like... Uh, I don't know. Maybe it really was a wasted trip in a sense. Maybe I don't if I stay went here to any longer than we have to, so let's just pick an approach and stick to it, okay? 
Just humor me. When the magic mirror showed me this apartment, I think I saw a knife inside, covered in what looked like blood. I wasn't expecting that. Yeah. Well, like I said, let's not overcomplicate things. You can question him while I look around for him. And if he objects? We're here on official Fabletown business, and we can be persuasive if necessary. Or you can. <laughs> okay. Um, right. What was I gonna say? Yeah, I feel like maybe if I chose Lawrence first, I could maybe have a chance of stopping it. Since... I don't know. Maybe it's just both gonna be like... I wouldn't say wasted trips, but like it's it both wouldn't be that... What? Grammar, please. Both wouldn't be... Uh, an emergency. Don't Hang just on. peep into someone's house. Check if he's home. Can you hear me? I guess I just opened the door then. Okay, it's been some time then. Yeah, it wasn't a, an emergency at all. Hey, somebody else was here, I think. He was not in this position. He was sitting upright. Oh my god. Oh wait. Hey, hey, stay with me, Lawrence. I'm gonna no, be alright. No. Let me go. What? <laughs> oh, shit. What is it that you're telling us? <gasps> Bigby. Water. water. Okay. Can I run now? Run? Wait, that's the bit. Okay. Water, water, water. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, come on. <laughs> the controls are so finicky. Well, I say finicky. I, I just, I'm probably very bad at controlling. If you have something to ask him, you should do it now. Who did this to you? <laughs> Faith. What? Faith did this to him. What does... What does that mean? Do you still have that letter? Oh, yes. that's true. I guess we can read it now. Should I open it? I'm not sure if it's right. You should. There might be something that helps us. A clue. Or a lead. I need to know. What does it say? I'm sorry. Fate. Oh. It's only two words, but he died without seeing them. I'm sorry too. We need to figure out what happened here and find whoever did this. So in a span of like two days, maybe? We've got two murders now. Hmm, that's a lot of blood on the chair as well. Hills. What are they? 
prescription sleeping pills. So he's not sleeping properly. Oh, and a gun. So he was shot as well. What is it? This gun wasn't fired recently. Maybe a week ago. Or more. Ah. Huh. Fingerprints? They'll be on the grip and the trigger. There's a bullet here as well. Bullet, I mean shell casing. Matches the caliber of the gun on the floor. Okay. Mm. That doesn't really help. <laughs> oh, I can't. All right. I thought I could uh, switch it on again. That's fine. Let's look at the knife. It's sharp. There's blood on the blade. Is that the same knife you saw in the mirror? Yeah. Yep. I don't know why it's over here. I just don't understand. Why would someone want to kill him? Covering up loose ends? I don't know. More blood here. Oh, something looks like it's moved. Strange. Hard edge to this pool, like something was here and got moved. Indeed. Hmm. Still a little sticky. So it's semi fresh, I guess. When do you think that was taken? Before all this. Bullet passed through the chair. Yeah. The angle works if he shot himself. Aww. So is that why he said Faith did this to him? Faith made him want to kill himself? Hmm, that is kind of grim. Secondhand paperbacks. Old encyclopedias. Dusty. No one's read these in a while. Okay, that's fine. Uh, wonder if there's anything I can search inside the kitchen. Goodbye. Wow, okay. So, somehow Faith left him a note saying that she wants to leave. And so he guess took it badly and just wanted to end everything that mm, i don't know Son of a... huh. what is that well we have to read it now Stuck to the bed a little. My dearest Faith, I never meant to hurt you, and I cannot endure knowing that I have. This was for the best. I'll see you again. Love. This was for the best. Heart. What do you mean? Hopefully they're together now. About all we can hope for at this point. Yep, true. I am so confused. So confused. And we pretty much don't have any leads right now. All led to a dead end. Mm. And I can't really examine Lawrence. As in like his wounds. It just brings me to this part. Which... There isn't anything... Oh. 
Okay, yeah, there isn't anything that I can interact with here. Hang on. If he sh he shot himself, then why why is there a big pool of unless he shot himself here? And, but the bullet is true here and went behind the wall. So how does that? How does this come about? Hmm, I don't know. Is there anything here then? Or I guess we leave? Oh wait, here. Ooh! Oh my goodness. Stay here. No. I'm not gonna lie, that <laughs> that scared the bejesus hey, out of me. Leave me alone! Oh man, this good time. Times. No, I hate the Q button. I hate this. I hate this mechanic so much. Um, it's gotta be this. Because it's opened. Thank you, Dust. Ooh. Almost missed that. Wow, you really can't take your eyes off this. Hey. Ease up, Bigby. We're on the same side here. You son of a bitch. Make me run after you. Why <coughs> did you run? What? Why did you run? Fuck, man. Because you chased after me. The fuck was I supposed to do? A man's dead. I know how it looks, but I had nothing to do with that. Bullshit. You're covered in blood. Look, I was just asking him about the girl. That's all. When I mentioned her being dead, he freaked out. I figured someone had told him. How was I supposed to know? Shit. Fucker shot himself right in front of me. I couldn't Whoa. stop him, man. No, hang on. You're looking for the woodsman, right? I know where he is. My guy says he's holed up at the trip trap. We can go over there right now, the both of us. My employer's looking to ask him a few questions, too. Who's your employer? I can't tell you that. It's confidential. Sorry. Sure you understand. Nope. Can't say that I do. Come on. You're coming with me. This could have been easy. Huh. Don't worry. It still is. Come on. Dumb. Dumb? Yeah, it is. Look, it'd be much easier for you no, to... No, I'm D. He's dumb. <gasps> <laughs> yep. I kind of knew that would happen, I think. He almost looked peaceful. Yep. I didn't get much Except out of him. You're lying in a dirty owl. Yep. With an open wound on the back of your head. Yep. Where'd they go? Well, after the one guy hit you and the other one finished kicking you. That explains the ribs. Then they jumped into a car and drove off. Come on, get up. Guess we're out of options. D mentioned the trip trap. Then that's where we'll go. I'll call a cab. Uh, D is lying about the gun, though. It's apparently not been fired for about a week. So, unless. Unless he's been there the for a I week. I'm getting a handle on what's going on. Things just get more complicated. It feels like we're always a step behind. 
Yeah, it does feel like that. the only lead we've got. And he was one of the last people to see Faith alive. And he apparently has something. Start to clear things up. I hope you're right. Bigby? Be honest with me. Who do you think... did this? I have no idea. I know it's still early, but... I just feel a step behind. Faith was in trouble. Afraid of someone. I need to find out who might be whoever she was working for. There's still a lot of questions. We find the woodsman, figure out what he knows, and go from there. Makes sense. That's probably the best approach. Yep. Oh, that's the <laughs> that's the guy that's that was in the in the corridor. Um. Thanks I for wish you. there was. <laughs> that Sorry. was funny. Go ahead. I didn't mean to cut you off. No, it's it's nothing. I just. Oh man. Seeing all this today, there are fables that are struggling worse than I'd imagined. We pay so much attention to the residents of the woodlands. You forget there's a whole community out there to serve. To have to turn to... prostitution. I... I wish there was more we could do. This isn't how I thought it would be. But Crane runs things his own way. You're doing your best. It's all anyone can do. Obviously, you that don't is know true. do all day. Right now... I'm the gatekeeper, making sure none of these disenfranchised folks are, as he puts it, wasting his time. You'll fix it. I don't know. It's just a broken system. The fables who walk in through the back door like Bluebeard, we have all the time in the world for them. You try and come in through the front door, through the proper channels, asking for anything, needing help. I turn you away. Ichabod Crane off, is the everything. problem. Well, that's not true. Right. We've had it worse, but not by much. Maybe this isn't for me. I thought public service was pure. You'll figure it out. You're better than I am with this political stuff. Well, that's not saying much. I trust you to make the right decision. <laughs> well, I do. I hope you're right. Yeah, maybe you should handle this one. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, maybe I should. Bigby. I... Um, just be careful. Please. I will try to. You too. The same goes for you. I will. Maybe I should have picked always. That might be fun to see. Oh, okay. Loading screen. The trip trap bar. Bronx. Come to think of it, I should try to save. I'm not sure if it has auto save. Oh, who is this? Uh oh. What do you want, Sheriff? I might not be that welcome in here. I'm looking for the woodsman. Well, he's not here. So I guess you can go now. Look, I'm not even gonna ask where he is now, okay? I just wanna know the last time he was here. That's all. 
Who? I'm being nice. So try again. He hasn't been here for a few weeks. No, maybe. I don't know. But yeah, he hasn't been here in a while, if he's been here at all, which... I don't know. <laughs> Um. Don't let him tell you what to do. You're your own woman. Well, this is me talking, Big B. Well, all right. Fuck off. Uh, let's see. There is pickled eggs. There is another cup here. Let me solve the mystery for you. They're pickled eggs. Oh, I know what they are. I'm just trying to figure out why anyone would eat this. <laughs> yeah. All right. Puff and Puff just noticed that the cigarette name is that. Oh, wait. Um. Settings. No. How do I save? I'm so scared of wait achievements. Oh, unlock all book of fable entries in episode one. I guess I skipped that. Complete chapter one of episode two. I see. So this must be all the okay. Oh, who is this? Glamorous, right. No, I want to know if I can save. Hmm. Oh, else. Can I? Okay, let's see. Damn. Right. <laughs> I don't have any money with me right now because I gave them all to Faith, I believe. Half empty glass. Oh, not that glass. Whose is that? Someone who left. Why didn't you dump it? If you want a cleaner place, feel free to get the fuck out of here. I'm sensing a very hostile tone from you. I don't deny it. I'm good at picking up on this stuff. Yeah. Matchbook. Oh. A lot of these walk out the door? Yeah, it's called advertising. <laughs> you get a refund? Fuck you. The word's getting out. Hmm. Hmm... I don't know. Cash only. Do I want to talk to him? I guess I have to. Oh, I can explore the rest of the stuff. So nice. You guys playing right now? Nah. Erase. Oh, that is so evil. H. Well, that'd be you, Holly. So, who's W D? No idea. Because it's also the first letter in the name. Woodsman. Yeah, I get it. Hmm. Yeah, let's not be evil and erase. Uh. Okay. Oh, maybe I should- uh, nah, I- I don't want to. A lot of stools in this place. <laughs> but there's only one right next to you. You gonna order something? Or are you just here to bother my customers? Hmm. 
You know what I mean. Give me a Midas gold. You want a lime? Sure. I think they have some at the bar down the street. <laughs> <laughs> think that's funny? Yep. Think it's fucking hilarious. I don't think I have right. the money to pay for it, though. Come on, guys. I don't want to be here. You don't want me here. The sooner you answer my questions, the sooner I'll be out of your... Uh-oh. That's gotta be the woodsman, right? <laughs> They're busted. So busted. Oh, yep. you're out of paper towels and. Uh... I can't believe I smiled as well. Saved your beer for you. Holly wanted to clear it, but uh, I said no. You'll be back. Now, here you are. You and me have been going at it for hundreds of years. I'm through fighting. Well, Woody, that makes two of us. You're in luck. I decided to switch seats. Just want to talk. This doesn't have to go like this. Maybe he don't want to talk to you. Why don't we let him tell me that? Okay, Griff. That's a very loyal friend, actually. I'm gonna try to not uh, be violent. Funny. Just a minute ago, no one seemed to know who you were. Yeah, well, everyone knows you. Big bad wolf. <laughs> now I'm the bad guy and you're a sheriff. What kind of fucking world is that, huh? Not exactly comfortable with it either, but... Hey, you play the hand you're dealt. Well, some folks are forced to play with shit. That's a lovely image. Guess you want to know about the girl. The yeah, I do. Things. Sure. I'd walked past her place for weeks. She didn't look like it. She had money. I was sure of it. She wouldn't put up any kind of fight. Oh, you're gonna steal from her. I was gonna right. Her. And the night I finally get up the nerve to do it, there you are, fucking things up for me. You were just in the wrong place at the wrong time. So... You were planning on robbing her? Yeah. Her and her grandma. Grandma? Wait, what are you talking about? Red Riding Hood. Her grandmother. I was there to rob him. Oh. Up, you were already there. Lying in the bed. I only saved her because I thought she might give me a reward. But she didn't give me shit. Except a bunch of people thinking I'm something I ain't. I played along as long as I could. Only thing I managed to get from it was a free drink every now and again. <laughs> Not a good that did. Hey, stop! This isn't what I want. Oh, shut the fuck up, Woody! Shit ain't just about you. It's about this fucking lapdog. And they come sniffing around this part of town when the rich fucks in the woodlands need a shakedown. Ain't that right, Bigby? It's not like that. There are problems with the way things go, I get it. But that's got nothing to do with what's happening right now. Holly's sister goes missing. No one gives two shits about her. Paperwork, waiting rooms, and that bitch Snow White looking right past me, then ushering me out the fucking door. Yeah, I'm not gonna... Too. 
Oh, good. Should have walked out of here when you had the chance. Come on, you're scaring the lady. Don't worry about me. <laughs> okay, okay. Guess we gotta do this anyway. I feel like I'm at a disadvantage here. That's gotta hurt so much. I'm not even awake at this point. Oh. Did I transform now? Looks like I did. so violent. I'm not even sure I should do this. Ow. He's had enough. Please, I need to calm down. Double. <laughs> she poured everything. Oh, I guess alcohol does change me back. How to pay though? Shit. It's not like you were gonna pay for it anyway. I would have paid for it, I guess. Uh, oh Don't well. Even think about it. Is this the type of treatment I can expect if I let you take me in? Hey, he started it. Oh. <laughs> he started it. <laughs> that is true, though. You gotta admit. Oh. I got a hundred bucks for the first bloke that can tell me something about a girl name. Fuck. Necessary. Shit. He's the one you want, not me. Your brother won't be saving you this time. Come on. You're under arrest. I told you I didn't do it. And you got nothing to worry about. Hmm, maybe I should have gone after the huntsman. Huntsman? Woodsman. Oh, I just noticed the saving icon as well. I guess it does save. And there's no hard save. 
Eh, alright. That's... Why are there flashing lights? Do anything stupid, and I'll throw you down the witching well myself. Glass super shoes. Wait. What? I guess another head. Another head. Oh no, who is it? No. You're kidding. <laughs> what an end we to the first chapter. Very special. Where's your brother? Fuck you! Give me one good reason I should tell you anything. Serial killer. Oh, oh my. A serial killer? Oh god, and it's one of us. Wait. The woodsman's still walking the streets. We've got to put a lid on this. If you can't manage it, I'll find someone who can. I found out where she's been staying. I know she's here. You must have seen her. What are the two of you hiding? Thanks for not saying anything. Oh. Doesn't matter. Maybe you just want to punish someone. We can arrange that. <sighs> what did you do? Uh, friend on friend. At the end of the end. Jesus Christ, Big B. Is that you? Whoa, I fully transformed. Smoke and mirrors. Woohoo. Next episode is pretty fun and interesting. Did you give your money to Faith? Woohoo, okay. Uh huh. 59% light. 69% went to help Toad. What happened to Prince Lord? You did not- <gasps> I could have prevented it. I am- Oh man, I am- Okay. You know, I might play this on my own uh, separately so that I can just see the other ending, I guess. Who is your prime suspect? Okay, the pimp. Right. Oh, this must be Bluebeard then. Okay, uh, who did you arrest? 8% make sure Twiddle D didn't get away. Alright. Interesting. And that was pretty fun. Um, and yeah, I think it should have saved. Um, and also I think I will stop it here. Uh, yeah, it's almost 6am and I actually need to go to the bathroom. Uh, yeah, so, and it's a nice break as well. Nice break. I mean, nice stopping point, the end of the episode. Um, next stream would be on... What day is it today? Saturday, I think. Uh, yeah, next stream would be Sunday afternoon, 2pm GMT plus 8. And um, if you want to find out what happens in the next episode of The Wolf Among Us, I will probably play it the same time as today, uh, which is Saturday morning, 3.30am, GMT plus 8. Yeah, so maybe I'll catch you again the next time. On Sunday, I'll be playing or continuing Yakuza Kiwami 2, so if you're interested in that, you can check it out as well. But yeah. I guess just thank you for watching, thank you for looking, and I'll see you the next time. Have a fantastic day.